Thank you. I'm not going to stop working. I'm not going to keep not talking to my colleagues, and I'm going to do everything I can to get this government back. So you stuck with me, but he did give me. You know, Leader McConnell has not, you know, put us first. He's played political games with people's lives. And, you know, I understand that many of my colleagues are millionaires, but not all of us have daddies to call to bail us out. Not all of us have these savings accounts. These are real people that provide services to our residents. It's getting harder, um, but we're holding on. We're coming to work and doing our job, and we're going to continue to do our job. It's not the public's fault that this is going on, and so we want to make sure that they get to their air, wherever they're flying to safely. It's demeaning, it's embarrassing. Um, for 30 years I've been working for the federal government. I've managed my bills. I'm, I'm a good steward of my money. But for somebody else to begin to dictate how I will have to live is not good. I'm, I'm angry about that.